We're standing here in front of one of our Civil War displays. And being a museum that had its origins in the Civil War, uh, built by Civil War veterans, our collection began there. I mean, the, some of these artifacts we have, we've owned for a hundred years, or near nearly a hundred years, which is really remarkable. Remarkable to think that they've never been outside this building. They've been in here for a hundred years. And one of, I think, one of the more significant and interesting pieces is the cap, the hat that's behind me, uh, was worn by a Lieutenant James Harbison. That's his portrait there. He was a soldier in the 139th Pennsylvania Volunteer Infantry uh, from Allegheny County. And at the Battle of Salem Church in May of 1863, he was killed by a bullet through the head. And if you look at his hat, you'll see the hole where the bullet entered through the hat and into his head, killing him. Now, uh, his brother was a sergeant serving under him in the same company. So, you know, obviously, uh, if you're the brother and you see your, your older brother or more senior and command brother fall, you're going to come to his aid and very quickly realize that his brother had passed. Uh, but he took a few things from the body, including the hat and his sash. And uh, in the 1920s, those were donated to us here at Soldiers and Sailors. And they really serve as a poignant reminder both of the war, the brotherly connection, and what we preserve here.